Choo chaga, choo chaga, choo 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 choo, choo chaga, choo chaga, choo 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 choo. Okay, so Justice. Yeah, let's do it over there. Okay, yeah, that's a good idea. Today is Saturday, October first, two thousand sixteen. This one doesn't have to go on mine. We just still, you know, just family. We'll always edit and decide. Side, exactly. So, yep, Saturday, October 1st, 2016. Where are we? George Washington's house um, at Mount Vernon. Is that amazing? Yeah. Is that incredible to know that we are actually at our first president's home? Yeah. And I, I, my maybe home is an understatement. Should we say compound? compound. Like, what did they say? Mansion. Mansion, 8,000 acres? Yes. Right? Justice. What's something, well, well, what's one of the, what was one of your highlights of the tour or of your, anything that you saw today? Uh, getting my token. Getting your token, right. I think you earned your token. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, <laughs> a, that's a better way to say. And Justice, can you talk about how exactly you earned your token and what you did? Okay, uh, Justice, now uh, you can talk without short me. puzzle, uh, fill in the blank with the words, and then from there, I just hand it in and get my token. That was great, and like... So, can you give us an example of what one of the one of the passages was? Uh, so one of them said something like Washington had 182 hogs to make his famous smoke blank. Uh huh. Uh, and something then, which is ham for some of it. All right, yeah. And then you would have to fill in the blanks, walk around the house, listen to the tour guides, mm -hmm. and just as I mean. You completed the tote, well, yeah, that's what the, they call them puzzles. You completed the puzzles really fast. How many puzzles were there total? Ten. Ten. Mm-hmm. It was eleven. It was ten. Ten? And you still have the paper, right? Yeah. That's good. And yet, also, I guess another one of the good highlights was that although, um, technically we only could get one token, Dad still made it so that each and every one of us was able to have a token. That was good. Mom, do you have any highlights? Um. Or you just enjoyed the fact of just grasping the knowledge and the education and yes, working as, as a family. Was my was there, is there any particular book that you think that you saw that you might want to look up? Um, there are four books. Four, okay. I'm interested in the book title America's Black Founders. I guess these okay. are the African Americans who were um, these are the African Americans that were involved in like I guess helping George Washington. Absolutely. That sounds like a very not well interesting. I was about to say interesting, but sometimes also, we use that yeah, word too much. Exactly, and people that also help up the, the African American contribution. Absolutely, to America. Mom. Yes. So I didn't want to purchase it from a bookstore because I believe it's probably more than likely a high markup. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to search for it either in the. You're not. <laughs> We're not going to record you. Always going to get in there. Oh, well, then feel free. <laughs> <laughs> um, we can... Um, yeah, the African-American contribution, contribution to, and, to America. And, and like you were talking about... The, no, 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 you were talking about the high markup. Oh, the high markup on right. the book. So I'm not sure. I'm sure there was a markup. I don't know how high. Right. But because I want to purchase books below market value because we have tons of books. I'm going to check our library, uh -huh. and I will see how that goes. And I also looked, um, I'm also interested in those four documents that I've seen on a homeschool website before. Okay, and what were those four documents, Ma, that you're interested in? I think it was the Declaration of Independence. Okay. The Constitution. Okay. There was it? I don't, I don't remember the other two. I don't remember what the other two documents were. But these documents are something that I would love for the brothers, for the brothers, um, to just write until they memorize it. So mm -hmm. I may consider these as memory work, and I like that they were in cursive. I do understand that some of the original documents 
in actuality were not in curses. Right. But I'd like them to be able to read that, um, well, that's, those type of documents in cursive. I think it just adds to the richness. Oh, Mom, you are so right about that. Yes. So very enthusiastic about that. And this camera is probably so close and my face is catching every nook and cranny. Oh, no, Mom, you're beautiful. No. The camera loves you and we, the camera loves you, Mom. You're beautiful. You think so? Oh, yeah, I know so. so but you look like, you look like the lady of wisdom today. I must say, you got, you don't, talk, talk about divergent thinking. Okay. You got your umbrella. Okay. It's, it's, it's like you don't need the cane, but you're looking like a, 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 a no, but the wisdom, the wisdom, oh, is that, is that young a, wisdom. Is that, a, is that a compliment? Oh, absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Wisdom could be old. Oh, no. That's a blessing, Mom. Good Lord. When our good Lord blesses us with wisdom. Oh, Mom, I think but you I, look, I think you look great for your age. I like using the umbrella. This is a sturdy umbrella as a walking Yes, stick. it's very sturdy. It turned out to, um, I like our matching, I like our matching shoes. You do? Me too. Yeah. One thing, we weren't cold. And yeah, that, see, right. Cold, that's the blessing. So yeah. where are we going now? So now we're going home, and we're probably going to go to the land of Nod as well, because we've had quite a fulfilled day. Huh? What'd you say? And... Oh, hey! Open the door. It's a. Quiet. And Yachty's not feeling too well because he's coming down with the fever, but all is well. Did you take your Motrin? You want one? Oh. Oh, he, he didn't take it. So you gotta take it because the fever keeps coming back every beautiful hour. You wanna take one now? Huh? Home sweet home, we are home sweet home. Earlier this week, the uh, letter from the birthday card arrived from my dad in prison, but this is just another one. Hear that rain? So let's just open this one up to all of my kids with parents in prison. I love you and I'm praying for you every day and I just pray that you're surrounded by family members and friends that love you and I also pray that in addition to that, that you make sure that you show appreciation to the family members that are there for you and to the family members that treat you with love because they go through a lot too. But it's about staying together, love, peace, unity, not judging each other based upon our differences, but understanding that it truly is our differences which actually bring us closer together. And that's what God wants us to understand and never get caught up on little things. All right. Okay. When you, when, when your parent is in prison and, and you see, like, I know for me, when I see these beautiful cars, it's like, I just, I, this is the, these are the things that I do not take for granted. I see a little photo in there. I save that for my eyes only. It's like the time and the effort that I, come on in. You can come, you can come, Justice, if you want. After I record, right. I'll come out. Thanks for checking on me. It's a little, <clears throat> the little rain is drizzling a little bit in the car. But yeah, so it's just, you know, you you, under, you, you appreciate when these are, you're like, you can go, you can go, your parent can go and buy you a car. But when your parent is in prison, you know, they actually have taken the time to trace these letters and to draw these letters and my dad has traced these letters for me and although he's not here with me it's just I still feel his love it's like wow my dad touched this card and although I can't physically touch his hand every day I can have this card to remind me of his presence and it's just a constant reminder for me to be thankful for what I do have rather than focusing on 
the fact that he may not be here with me physically. Although sometimes we know with our, when our, if we have parents in prison that it can get emotionally tough. And look at this. Our, this is okay. Uh, this is my dad's handwriting right here. I already knew just by, just by, I know his penmanship. But these are other, these are his um. Oh yeah, remember? Let me see. There, okay, where's okay? Oh yeah, remember JoJo? Remember JoJo? That's the one who wished me twenty fourth birthday. These are all of his Christian brothers. Remember they have turned their life over to Christ and who we sent their certificates to. Happy 24th birthday, Destiny. And I pray and hope that you enjoy it. I, and I j just wish me and your dad could have been there to enjoy it with you, JoJo. So let me see. A birthday greeting. Best wishes and happy birthday. And Jigga, he says, may this, may this day that's all your own hold happiness for you. And may the year ahead be filled with all the best things too. Happy birthday. Oh, bless his heart. My dad, princess, enjoy your 24th year on this earth. I know this year your great and your great ideas will ex will explore you will explore you too much success. Love you all the muchest, your daddy. PS. The picture is of Frank. Frank is another one of our um our um brothers who who devoted his life over to Yeshua and to Yahweh. This is Frank here. In Judaism, we are taught that everybody plays a factor in perfecting the world. Your birth proves that you are in plan of perfection. Oh, bless your heart, Frank. May you lot in life be successful and may you have many more days on earth to perfect the world, to perfect this world. God bless you. Happy belated birthday from Pierre. Let's see who this is. Oh, th okay, this is Pierre. Okay. Friend, I'm so sorry for the delay. I take full responsibility for this not getting to you on your birthday. I know we haven't spoken in a while, but I know that God is taking great care of you and the family. Smiley face. I wish you the best belated birthday one could have. With that being said, French poet and philosopher Apollinaire wrote, Hey, come to the edge. We can't. We are afraid. Come to the edge. We can't. We fall. Come to the edge. And they came and we pushed them and they flew. Happy belated birthday from Pierre. Okay, and this is Kenneth. Okay, so Ken Kenneth, I believe that Kenneth is the, um, I believe Kenneth and I shared the exact same birthday. It's just that we're one year apart. Okay, his handwriting is beautiful. John 6, 63, Destiny, happy belated Happy, oh wow, it's, okay. Happy belated destiny. You see how the handwriting is eloquent? But let me see. Happy belated something day. It's a wonderful blessing to see another birthday. Like I'm only reading what it is that I can just gather from his quite curvy worthy handwriting trusting in the most high our god our lord and savior Letting him give you life in abundance bless your heart what else having you give you life okay what else can you ask for happy birthday sister in christ from kenneth okay well there you go i feel the love i feel the love god is just so good god is just so good to check to check Two, 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 two. Two, 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 two.